and back home a united opposition is expected to stall proceedings in parliament for another day on the issue of the conversion controversy now on tuesday opposition mp is led by congress reached the well of the house raised anti government slogans demanding an explanation from prime minister narendra modi the log jam in parliament continues to keep major reforms bills like the insurance and companies bill in limbo the opposition protested after bjp mp yogi adityanath's comment supporting mass conversion programs the bjp government has distanced itself from religious conversions in uttar pradesh yogi adityanath said he will go ahead with the reconversion drive planned by his outfit the hindu yuva vahini in gorakhpur the hindu yuva vahini is keeping the location of the ceremony under wraps but the gorakhpur police is on high alert cracking the whip on alleged conversion police arrested more than 30 members of the hindu yuva vahini in kushinagar and gazipur districts of uttar pradesh and headlines today is ashar ahmed khan now joins me with the latest on the story ashar you've been speaking to your sources in the congress party are they spearheading this opposition on slot and what's their strategy today well the strategy is clear what the congress party is doing is that it has got the entire opposition in the rat sabha united a secondly they say that the home minister gave us an assurance and before that even the prime minister came and said that uh, you know such uh, statements which were made one of by one of his ministers are unacceptable even after that such utterances are coming from beat sakshi maharaj beat yogi adityanath who are sitting mps of the bjp so the opposition says that we want another assurance from none less than the prime minister or is the prime minister and uh, uh, advice is not being heeded to by uh, his party mp so these are the things which uh, clearly the opposition wants clarified well when we ask them that what about the important reform bills they say if the bjp was interested in reforms they should have passed this bill in 2008 when the upa congress led upa government bought it so clearly politics being played out in all this